the Staples Center where it very well could be the end of an era for the Arizona men's basketball program. After 24 consecutive NCAA tournament appearances, their streak is in major, major jeopardy after losing to ASU today in the first round of the Pac-10 men's basketball tournament here in Los Angeles. The loss dropped the Wildcats to 19 and 13 overall, 9 and 10 in the Pac-10, and well, if they want to make the NCAA tournament, and it's not out of reach, they're going to need the other bubble teams around the country to lose during their own conference tournaments if they have any shot. Now for Arizona, their regular season is over. They have no more chances at improving their resume. So as it stands right now, they've got an RPI in the 50s, which is not too bad. They've got a strength of schedule in the 30s, which is just OK. And they've got some quality wins over some opponents earlier in the season. Remember, they beat Gonzaga, they beat Kansas, they had a quality win over UCLA, over Washington. Those are all great wins that the NCAA Tournament Committee are going to look at. And with only 19 wins this season, it's really hard to go up against other teams on the bubble that have 21, 22, and even 23 wins looking to get their own NCAA Tournament berth. The only number that really matters for the Wildcats right now is three as in 3 o'clock on Sunday when they'll determine their fate for their postseason chances, whether that be in the NCAA tournament or in the NIT. Reporting from Los Angeles for DailyWildcat.com, I'm Brian Roy.